Hi everybody, I'm finally here. You know when you think of LA, you think of Hollywood, and when you think of Hollywood, you've got to come here. It's the Hollywood side. This is the place. I think one of my most exciting moments is to walk the red carpet, you know, and then to meet all those famous people. I think one of my best was last night, able to stand beside Sir Anthony Hopkins. Was like. I was shaking. He was just my hero, and of course, to be able to stand beside George Lucas was like, I tell you, my photograph was all over Singapore and Taiwan before I knew it. Before my company, Universal Record Music, you know, before they actually released the news, it was just out there. The people already picked up the news. It was just fantastic to have that kind of experience. I really feel like these few days I've grown up so much, you know, and to meet these important people. I just really think that in in our industry, you know, connection is quite important, and and it's it's very inspiring to meet these people. I just really feel that I'll do better. Yes, I'm actually really excited about the song because. Um, I've been doing Mandarin pop for a while, so to do these English songs and they are dance tracks, so it's really up tempo, you know, and it was just groovy. It was it was fun for me recording it, and actually the songs are written by Peter Rafferson and recorded by him. Actually, when I first heard Peter Rafferson, I was like shocked because I know that you know he's the man that wrote "Open Your Heart" for Madonna, and everybody knows that. That song, that album sold for like 27 million copies. It's just fantastic that you know we get hooked up, and and uh, he's just so kind to me. After my 80 concerts, I think the first place I want to go is Miami. Miami, it's beautiful. You know, I can take a rest, go to the spa, beach, and all this. But I also wish that I can perform there. And then I would like to go to New York, where everything is really happening. The music 